What's going on guys and girls, it is Preston here today and welcome to another video. So today we're going to be talking about something that I actually talked about a while ago on my channel, but it's been quite some time, so I wanted to go ahead and kind of rekindle the fire with this subject because one, people like to talk about it, two, it generally brings in a decent amount of views, going to be honest with you guys, and three, like I said, it's been a long time since I actually talked about it. We're talking about my opinion on steroids, so you know, just like what do I think about them, are they good, are they bad, are they cheating? And we're also going to go over if your man is still natural or not because a lot of people have been questioning me um, due to the amount of size I've been putting on and also the fact that I'm getting leaner and I haven't had really any decrease in my strength uh, and I actually seem to be getting bigger while I'm also on a cut. So we're going to be going over all of that in this video. All right, so to go ahead and start off, what are my opinions on steroids? How do I feel about them? You know, are they cheating? You know, are, are they not cheating? Uh, what do I think about steroids as a whole? So personally, I have nothing wrong with steroids and I have nothing wrong with somebody who takes them. Now, that doesn't mean that I think it's a good idea or that I would advocate for someone to take steroids. Uh, it just means that I'm not gonna view somebody really any differently to the extent of disliking their character. You know, there's a lot of great people out there that take steroids. Um, there's a lot of great people out there that also are, are uneducated. You know, and there's also some people that are educated and they've decided to put themselves at risk. So um, I will not view somebody differently if they take steroids uh, to, to, to the extent of disliking them, but I will view them as somebody who is making a decision that could affect their life and could uh, affect their ability to, to, to bring in life, you know, to actually like re to have kids and to reproduce. So, um, yeah, I don't think they're a bad thing. I don't think people that take them are bad, but I do make a judgment of somebody's character uh, when they are taking them. Now, like I said, I don't judge them negatively and immediately go, oh, they take steroids and then I have this bad view of them and I think it changes who they are, right? But I do make a judgment of one's character if they're willing to do such a thing. So with that said, do I think they're a bad thing? No, I don't, uh, because they're also used in the medical field, um, but they're, you know, they're actually called hormone replacement therapy, right? It's HRT. I think that that's great. I mean, people need it when, when like, they get older. So don't think that they're a bad thing. I just think that they get a bad rap, but they are a dangerous thing. One thing I also do not advocate um, when taking steroids is lying about your natural status. I do not like the fact that people will do that. They will sell false hope. They'll say they're natural, blah, 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 but really they're roided out and it's just not smart. It really just is not a good way to live. They're always living in a lie and they're selling false products and they're selling false hope for natural athletes. Like As I said, I don't think that steroids are a bad thing. I think that they are quite neutral depending on how they are used. I do not advocate anybody to be a fake natural. That's the one part of steroids that I don't like. That is one thing that I can say wholeheartedly that I do not support is people taking steroids and lying about it. That's just wrong. Do I think that steroids are cheating? No, not at all. They're not cheating whatsoever. And here's why. People that think steroids are cheating are people that are uneducated. They're people that have no idea what is going on in bodybuilding or fitness as a whole. And they're people that generally just don't want to take the time to think of any other insult or judgment. It's easy to look at somebody and just say he takes steroids, therefore he's cheating. Because when somebody says something, they have to note what somebody's doing, right? This is how judgment works. They look at somebody and they say, hey, that guy's doing steroids. Now they could just stop there, right? And just keep it as an observation and just be like, oh, that, that guy's doing steroids. That guy's drinking a cup of coffee. That guy's doing that. But instead, they make a judgment based off the observation and they go, that guy's taking steroids, therefore he's cheating. Why? How is he cheating? Now, if they were to say, that guy's taking steroids and it's affecting his health, that makes more sense because there is evidence to back that. But you cannot make a judgment. It's, it's like saying, that guy takes steroids, therefore he's an asshole. You're trying to judge something off of zero evidence. There's evidence about it, you know, making people have side effects and all these terrible things. And if the guy's being an asshole, then okay, you can easily make that judgment. 
but it doesn't make any sense to just say that they're cheating because you don't understand the sport. You don't understand that. And even then, none of us are all really doctors out here. I mean, we're all in fitness. Unless you are a doctor, great for you. But none of us even have the right to even make a medical diagnosis on somebody taking steroids. We don't know that. I'm not a doctor. So, I mean, no, I say all this stuff about it being bad for you. That is, though, based off of the research that I've read. So, at the end of the day, guys, it's... Okay, I'm going on a rant. Either way, it's not cheating. Because here's why. In bodybuilding and the fitness industry, there is not a written law that says that if you are taking steroids, you are cheating. However, if you are competing in a natural show and you are taking steroids, then you are cheating. That is it. Otherwise, it's free game. You're allowed to do whatever you want in fitness. You're not cheating. And then somebody will say this. Well, the steroids help them get bigger faster and they help them recover faster and blah, blah, blah. And when they say that, it's absolute BS because everybody else is doing them. It'd be different if it was everybody was natural and they're the only ones doing it. Everyone is doing them in bodybuilding for the most part at a competitive level. You are putting yourself at a disadvantage. It's not cheating if everybody's doing it. That's the thing. And also if there isn't a written thing in the rule brick for the sport. It is for natural shows. You can't be on any substances. It's not for regular bodybuilding or in fitness. It doesn't say when you join the gym, like you can't do steroids. It just says you can't do steroids in our building, but they're not banning it in fitness. See what I'm trying to say? So it's not cheating. If you work out at the gym and don't even compete and are just involved in fitness and take steroids, you are not cheating. It's not a matter of, oh, this guy gets a cheat code and now he's able to do all this stuff that I can't. When you are natural, you are here. You might be here, you might be there, but here's your range right here. When you're on steroids, you start here. A natural person will never be able to get to where this unnatural person is based off their hormones. Now, some of these guys might look better than some of these guys, right? They might be a little bit higher, but at the end of the day, your body reaches a point where it cannot get any bigger. You max out your muscle, that's it. Steroid guys can go to that next level. It allows them to take their physique to the next level. What comes with that? Well, generally they get faster recovery, they can work out more, they can train harder because they're on another level. It's not a matter of trying to point them out and say, gosh, you know, it's not fair that you get all these benefits you know, you're cheating because you're ahead of me. But would a football player playing college ball call out the NFL players and say, you're cheating. You get all these better benefits than me. You get better uniforms. You get better food. You get better rest and recovery. You make more money. It's cheating that you get that and I don't. Well, they look at you and go, we'll get in the fucking NFL and then we'll talk. I'm trying to give you guys an example. They're on another level. And if you want to go to that level, if you have enough drive and you think you're good enough and you have good enough genetics and it's your passion, then you'll do anything to do that, including putting your health at risk. So that is my opinion on steroids, whether they're good or bad, my thoughts on fake naturals, also my thoughts on if it's cheating or not. Now, the drum roll. We never supported the video that I'm sure a lot of you guys have either skipped to or have been wanting to watch. And it is whether or not I am still natural. And it has been the same answer ever since the beginning. I do not plan to have it change anytime soon for I am making tremendous gains right now and I don't really feel the need uh, to make a change in my life. Am I natural or am I on the secret sauce? I can say wholeheartedly, 100%, that I am natural. I've been natural since the start. I plan to stay natural. I enjoy the natural lifestyle. I've been able to achieve a physique, weighing up to 225 pounds. I've gotten my bench press almost to a 315 incline. I'm not bragging. These are things that I wanted to accomplish and that I honestly didn't think would be possible naturally when I first started, but then I educated myself and I started to eat the right food and I bulked and I realized that you can do a lot naturally. So. Basically, I'm achieving all my dreams naturally, so I have no reason to need to hop on steroids. And also, even if I even thought in the slightest bit of hopping on them, I would never do it because I actually wrote a paper when I was younger on steroids uh, for one of my writing classes in college, and I learned a lot about them. 
I am 100% natural, plan to be natural for the rest of my life. That is my answer. Your man is 100% lean, grass-fed, all organic beef, baby. 100%, uh, no steroids here. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys haven't already, please smash the like button. Comment down below if you guys thought that I was gonna come out and say that I wasn't natural, or comment down below and say you guys already knew that I always was natural. Also, if you guys haven't, please subscribe. This is the first time I've ever been uploaded consistently, and I now have an upload schedule. I post on Wednesdays and Saturdays now. It feels really, really good. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed the video. Once again, please smash the like button, comment down below, subscribe for more content from yours truly, and I will see you guys in the next video. Stay natural, stay Myron, stay shredding.